היי, הלו הלו וונדר יוגיז, היי דן היר, אין אין דיס וידאו, אני גונה שואו איתו טרי יוגה סטרצ'ס, פור ראנרס. So if you're ready, let's begin. Ooh, I forgot something. Amazing. Now let's hop to the stretches. The first pose to increase our arm strength to stretch the legs for a better run is pyramid pose. It's done very easily. You start standing on the top of the mat, feet parallel, hip width distance, and then you send one leg backwards. I start with the left one. Mm -hmm. Left foot pointing 45 degrees outside, the right pointing forward. Now the hips, you twist the hips to, to point the front of the mat. If you need, you can adjust the legs, maybe the left a little bit to the left, the right a, li a little bit to the right. And from here, you grab the opposite elbows behind your back. You breathe in, you smile. And you exhale, reach forward from the hips, keeping the front knee long until the front leg saying, that's it, no more. And you hold, you look down to the ground, and you're going to feel a good stretch on the arm string. Now, this is the first variation. The second variation is with your hands down on the ground, a bit more deep variation. You lean forward towards the front leg. hands down. If it's too much and you can't reach, you can use blocks if you have, or maybe books to elevate the ground towards you. Same thing. You reach forward towards the leg. If you, if you need, you can even bend the elbows backwards to go deeper. And you hold. You hold for about 30 seconds. And then you come up. Release and do it on the other side as well. Foot pointing 45 degrees out, hips pointing forward, elbows behind the back or down on the ground. You reach forward. Oh, and you hold in here. 30 seconds with your hands behind the back or down on the ground if you want to go deeper. And that's it. Enjoy. Let's move to the second stretch. The second stretch is a combination between a dynamic and static stretch. My favorite one to increase the arm flex flexibility and elasticity. Mm -hmm. It's done very simple. The name is low lunge to half split. It's done very easily. You start with your hands down. You place one leg in the top of the mat in between the legs, in, the, in between your hands. And you lean forward, hips down to the ground, fingertips down on the mat into low lunge. From here, you switch backwards, li lifting the toes up, heel staying down, and you straighten the leg into half split. You keep the knee in 90 degrees. Don't sit down. Mm -mm -mm. Sit up. Straighten the back. Look forward, lean forward from the hips, fingertips down, and this is the half split. Now you do it dynamic at first to warm up the arm string, especially if you can't straighten the arm string, the leg all the way. So you start with dynamic movement. You start in low lunge and switch backwards. Half split, low lunge, half split. If it's challenging, you can use yoga blocks if you have, or maybe books. Simple books to elevate the ground towards you. And you move back and forth, stretching the armstring. And after three to five stretch like this, dynamic one, you hold F split. You can send the heel a bit forward, suck in the belly, and lean forward towards the front leg. Keep your toes flexed at all time, and you're going to feel a good stretch on the arm string. Very simple stretch. Remember to do it on both sides. Amazing. Let's move to the third one. The third stretch is a wonderful stretch, very simple to do, 
and it's called the arm string stretcher. This is the name I gave her. Um, and it's done with a towel. Mm -hmm. So for this one, you're going to need a towel, a simple towel. Go to your bathroom and grab a towel. You fold it into a long towel and then you lay on your back. Oh, yeah. You lay on your back, both feet down on the ground. And what you do is very simple. You take your towel, place it on the sole of one foot. I start with the right one. Then you place it on the sole of the foot and you send the heel up to the sky, toes towards you, and you keep your knee bent at first. You pull the leg towards you and gonna feel a good stretch on the arm string, of course. From here, if it feels comfortable, you can slowly straighten the other leg down to the ground, keep it flexed as well. You hold it in here, here reaching up to the sky, toes towards you. And after a few breaths, you can send the heel higher to the sky and straighten the knee. And you're going to feel a good stretch on the arm string and even the calf muscle. Ah, very great in the recovery day. Oh, to release the tension in the muscles, to keep them healthy, elastic. And that's it. You hold this one for a minute or two. You breathe in, you breathe out, and then you release. You shake it out, and you, of course, repeat on both sides. You place it on the sole of the foot, send the leg up, straighten the other one down, and when it feels comfortable, you can send the heel up, straighten the knee. Oh, and feel the stretch. Simple. That's it. You see, very simple stretches to keep the arm string healthy, mm -hmm. to keep them elastic, to keep them long and avoid injuries. Mm -hmm. Very, very important. Simply do those stretches as part of your daily routine. Maybe after a long run or your, on your rest day, do those stretches to keep your arm string in top shape. Mm -hmm. Uh, if you enjoyed this video and you find it helpful, remember to give this video a thumbs up mm -hmm. and let me know in the comments below which of the stretches you like the most, which one you find most helpful for you. Also, if you have a friend, a family or a bestie that runs with you as well or love running, remember to click share and send it over to them so they can enjoy this one as well. I will see you here on the next video. Until then, always remember to do yoga. It just makes life better. Ciao, ciao.